Welcome to Nickelodeon's Robot Wars, where today you're going to see the U.S. against the U.K. in an international tag team championship. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, please welcome the master of mechanical mayhem, Nickelodeon's Dave Azer. Welcome to Nickelodeon Robot Wars. It's the best of the U.S. versus the best of the U.K. today as our matchups take on a wrestling flavor. Two teams of U.S. robots and two teams of U.K. robots will battle each other to determine a U.S. and U.K. tag team champion. Then, each country's champs will go face-to-face -face in a final battle for the chance to be named the international tag team champions. It's double the robots, twice the action, and two times the damage. So let's go down to the pitch and Vivian Collins to get more of the story. Viv? The heat is on and so is the armor as the robotic warriors try to shield themselves from their competitors and most of all, the wrath of the house bots. I'm hanging out with a bunch of fans down here in the pits. The roboteers are trying to hash out last minute strategies. They're trying to gain any advantage possible before going out into the arena. Back to you, Dave. The tag team competition requires revising the strategy you'd use with a single robot. Our teams are frantically finalizing their plans of attack right now. Let's go to the battle board and find out who's up first. All right, Dave, first up, to determine the U.S. tag team champion, we've got the U.S. qualifier with Zansara and Runaway teaming up against the Revolutionist and Spin Doctor. You better hold on to your seats for this one. Here's our first U.S. tag team, Zanzara and Runaway, both running spinning blades for weapons and electric motors for drive power. This is Team Creative Steel with Zanzara. This is Team One and Mocha with Runaway. We teamed up for the national tag team. All the other robots, beware. From Florida, the revolutionist. From Florida, Spin Doctor. The tag team fighting them to find out who's the best U.S. team will be the Revolutionist and the Spin Doctor. Both of them have spinning discs with teeth on them for weapons. Hi, we're Team Logic Common. We're with Spin Doctor, and we've teamed up with Revolutionist. Hi, I'm here for the tag team, and we're going to shred the competition. Yeah. Roboteer, stand by. And there's the Spin Doctor Revolutionist team up at the booth, raring to go, and run away in Sanzara. And the house bots guarding the corner patrol zones will be shunt with that axe. And Matilda with a lifting spikes and interchangeable tail weapons. Three, two, one. And here we go to decide the best U.S. tag team. Zanzara and Spin Doctor collide immediately. Zanzara and Spin Doctor went head on and somebody lost some parts. Both of them are running spinning discs. And it's really hard to tell right now who it was that lost. Off of that first contact, now the revolutionist tags in for Spin Doctor. Zanzara still looking for a tag and... Oh! The revolutionist up at a thousand RPM speed completely pushes Zanzara out of the way. Look at the power. Poor Zanzara looks immobilized. Now somebody's hit that pit trigger, so that pit is wide open as RefBot comes in to take a look. Runaway goes into the corner patrol zone of Shunt. Bad move for Runaway's part if they've ever seen what Shunt can do. And there, Spin Doctor just sitting there as Shunt pushes Runaway right across the arena. And Matilda goes for Zanzara. A 
upsets the immobilized Zanzara upside down. We don't think that's going to move. Now Refbox doing the countdown because Zanzara and Runaway are both immobilized, which is just a really tough break for that team. But this is for the U.S. Championship, so anything could happen as Matilda and Shut do a little cleanup on those robots. Wow! The whole team got flipped at the same time. Well, you won't see that too often. Both of them lined up on the flipper. Zanzara and Runaway just got jettisoned out into the stratosphere. And now Runaway hits the pit. Wow. They didn't mess around Six. there. So I was watching a tag team match, and I thought what was going to happen is that you guys were going to tag each other in. But I look up, and next thing I know, there's four robots in the ring. How did that happen? What happened out there? Well, the, our teammates were in trouble. So you had to go bail your teammate out, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now over here to this team, you guys were successful, and you won this match. What's it like when you're competing against all these robots? What's the strategy? Well, we spin up, so if both attack us, we can hit both at the same time, and they won't hurt us. All right, that's an excellent strategy. Now you guys are going to get a chance to sit back and watch the next match. What are you thinking? Can you beat the British team? Well, we'll try our hardest, and hopefully we'll shred through them. All right, guys, a big round of applause for both of our teams. A great match. Give it up for them. Well, coming up next, it's going to be the UK Tag Team Qualifier with some awesome bots. You're not going to want to miss this. Welcome back to Robot Wars. Have you ever seen robots wrestle? You have if you've been watching today's International Tag Team Terror. We've already eliminated one U.S. team, sending the Revolutionist and Spin Doctor on to the finals. Right now, the British teams are preparing for their match. Let's go to the battle board and find out who's up. All right, Dave, for the UK qualifier, we're going to see Bigger Brother teaming up with Cat 3, and they're going up against Ming 3 and Rick. From Hampshire, Rick. From Somerset, Ming 3. First UK team, Ming 3, with a crusher arm and a lifting arm at the rear, and a spinning disc and a pneumatic flipper for Rick. Hi, I'm Francis, and this is our robot Rick. This is my dad, Kevin, and my mate, Ian. We're tagged up with Ming because we're going to beat the Americans. Hi, I'm Alex. This is my brother, Oliver, and my dad, Andrew. This is our robot Ming-3 with a big crusher to crush the opposition. From Sussex, Bigger Brother. From Surrey, Cat-3. And the other UK team is Bigger Brother with an amazing flipping arm. And Cat-3 boasting an axe that's supposed to be more powerful than shunts. <laughs> we'll see. My name is Joe Watts, this is my sister Ellie, this is my dad, and this is our robot bigger brother. I'm Jade, and this is George, and this is Ian, and this is our robot Cat 3, and we're going to take on the Americans and win. Roboteer, stand by. There's the Ming 3 and Rick team up in the booth, and there's bigger brother and Cat 3 up in the booth. And in the corner patrol zones are CPZs. We're seeing dead metal with that spinning disc. And the big granddaddy of them all, Sir K. Three, two, one. Activate. And the green light shown by Rapfire, which means it's the beginning of the round. Let's see who's going to be the toughest UK team. Cat 3 swings down with that powerful axe, but we didn't see any damage from it as Rick is trying to get a little bit of angle on him with that flipping arm. Rick is getting up and under Cat 3 and flips Cat 3 up on the side. Good bit of driving ability on Rick's part with that flipping arm doing major damage on Cat 3. And now the rules have gone out the window. They're supposed to tag up, but they're all in on the action now as Ming 3 drags Cat 3 right out into the center of the arena. 
And now, Bigger Brother's looking for some revenge. He's got Ming-3 up against the rails, but Ming-3 gets out of it. That flipping arm on Bigger Brother is awesome. He has got total control in this arena. Wow. But Ming-3 has got a trick up its sleeve. It has a self-riding mechanism, brought himself right back. And now he's crushing right down into the side of Bigger Brother for a little payback. And that lifting arm of Bigger Brother got him out of trouble more than one time. As Ming-3 is looking for somebody to chomp down into. And Cat-3 has got that axe buried right into the side of Bigger Brother. Stuck on the spinning arena disc now. It looks like Cat-3 might have a little bit of trouble. They're not moving. But Bigger Brother is definitely doing the work of both bots here. As Ming-3 is up against the rails. And Bigger Brother helps him out just for a second. What an amazing tag team battle this is. Ming-3 doing his best to stay out there and do some damage. But Bigger Brother has got the bigger pushing power. And he's got Ming-3 up against the rails again. And Rick comes in with that lifting arm to help out a little bit. The count is going down. And if this one goes down with both teams still working, it's going to have to go to a judge's Cease. decision. Oh, boy. I wouldn't want to have to choose between those two teams. That was close. So while wow, those judges are trying to decide, let's take a look at some of that action. It was all about the flippers in this round. Everybody got in on the action. Nobody was laying behind. And that battle was neck and neck from beginning to end. The judges took a lot of time to deliberate that one, but they have made their decision, and the team that has won and is moving on to the International Tag Team Championship is the team of Ming-3 and Rick. They have won the match. Okay, guys, you won the match. You're moving on. You're going to play in the championship round. How do you feel? Happy. Happy? You, you sure about that? No. Yeah. You definitely have some tough, opponent, uh, tough opponents ahead of you. Have you guys had a chance to uh, scout your opponents out at all? Do you know anything about the teams you're going to be facing? No problem. No problem. All right. I like the confidence. Well, this was one of the better matches we've had, so I think fans give both teams an enormous round of applause on a great match. Two great teams. Give it up for you. Well, there we have our finalists for UK and the US. But first up, let's check out the lineup for third and fourth place playoff, who are down on the pits with Vivian right now. We are getting ready for the playoffs for third and fourth place in the international tag team competition, US versus UK, but a whole lot has changed. Now, remember, we were supposed to see Big Brother and Cat 3 taking on the US team, but take a look. We only have Jade here, and she's just wearing cat ears. Where's Cat 3? Um, well, the other two have off to fix Cat because I had a big blow in the last round, so I'm here with. Big Brother. All right, so we've got Big Brother over here. Tell me, Ellie, what do you plan to do to the other team? Well, it's a secret. Ooh. We can't tell you. You can't tell me? Not even a little bit. Yeah. No. No. You have so, to watch. If uh, it goes all right, if you have to, and you're good, and it should be the exact how we planned. Mm, exactly how they planned. Well, let's take a look over here. It was supposed to be Zanzara and Runaway taking on Big Brother, but it's only Zanzara. What happened to Runaway? Well, Runaway just got beaten up too much. Mm hmm. Now, how's Zanzara doing? Well, its weapons kind of broke, so. Mm hmm. So, what are you going to use then? We're just going to try to ram them. Ram them a lot. Well, they said they've got a secret weapon. Do you have a little secret plan? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No one's telling. Stick around because the playoffs for third and fourth place in the international tag team competition are about to start. There's Jordan and Max for Zanzara, and Ian, Ellie, Joe, and Jade for Bigger Brother. The house bots guarding the corner patrol zones now will be dead metal. And 
Join in that metal shot with that axe. Three, two, one. Activate. Here we go for third and fourth place. Sanzara immediately takes evasive action, but not evasive enough as Big Brother slams Sanzara right into the rail. Look at the power going on there. Well, Sanzara thought they were going to be ramming, but they're getting rammed more like. As Bigger Brother is just showing that dominance of that hydraulic lifting arm. Poor Zanzara right into the spinning disc trigger. Which means any bot with low clearance trying to cross over that thing's gonna have a lot of trouble. And here comes Bigger Brother putting Zanzara right into the rail. Oh, Jordan is just looking on in disbelief. Poor Zanzara doesn't have what it takes to get off the side. And in comes Shunt with that axe. As RefBot's having a closer look. But Shunt actually helped out Zanzara. Got him back on the wheels. A little bit of a reprieve. As Dead Metal comes in with that saw and the pincers. Bigger Brother is just trying to figure out what to do next as Zanzara takes another shot from Bigger Brother as the 10 second clock counts down. Wow, if these guys aren't immobilized, it'll have to go to a judge's decision again. Jeez. And Zanzara got lucky that time. Well, if we look at the damage Bigger Brother was doing, I don't think it's going to be too hard a decision for those judges. Poor Zanzara was getting shredded right from the beginning. And the judges have made their decision, and the winner of that bout was the team Bigger Brother. Well, let's talk to the Zanzara team, and I really want to give you guys a lot of credit for a couple of reasons. One, in that match, you battled an awful lot, and two, there was a chance you weren't even going to be ready for that match. You had to do a lot of uh, a lot of alterations on your robot just to get ready. Tell me about that. Yeah, we took a lot of damage in the last match, and we just about didn't make it. It was it was. I mean, there's there's a lot not even bolts not tight and glue not dry and you name it. It's not. It was almost didn't make it. I know you aren't happy with the way it turned out, but do you feel you feel a little better because you kept competing? Yeah. Well, that's great. I think a hand to this team also for uh, like I said, really competing all the way through. Now over to you guys, Ellie and Joe. What was your favorite part? What was the most exciting part of that match? My favorite part was when we were flipping him up. <laughs> I don't think that was his favorite part, though, but yeah. Okay, anything you want to add? Was there anything else about that match that you liked? I liked it when he was fed to the house robots. They like flipping you around, apparently. That's all, right. all right, well, that's fine. One more time, a round of applause for both of our teams. Here today, great competition, great match. When we come back, it's finals time with Ming 3 and Rick for the UK up against Revolutionist and Spin Doctor. You are watching your games, your sports, Nick Gas. You are watching. Nick Gas. Tag team battles mean double the action and double the danger. Which pair will emerge as our tag team champs? Let's not wait any longer to find out. Here's the lineup for the finals, Dave. The Revolutionist and Spin Doctor for America and Ming 3 and Rick for the UK. Kingdom, Ming 3 and Rick up in the box. And there's the Americans, Revolutionist and Spin Doctor. And Sir K guarding the corner patrol zone. And joining him, the first appearance from Sergeant Bash. Three, two, one. Activate. Well, Spin Doctor starts off for the U.S. 
And there's Ming-3 starting out for the UK. Ming-3's got its jaws wide open. As it looks like the Spin Doctor might have to do some evasive movement. And the Revolutionist comes in. Spinning at over 1,000 RPM. You don't want to get in the way of that thing. And it looks like Rick is tagged up for the UK. Rick goes in there. Revolutionist is hanging right in front of those grinders. Look at the air off a of Revolutionist. Goes right into the corner patrol zone. And Rick goes in there with that police up glide, lifting on. All oh, the house bots are in the corner with him. Bash goes in. Sir K goes in. Look at that again. We saw Rick go in with that flipping arm and take Revolutionist up and over. Great teamwork in there. Now we're looking at Bash. And Sir K is taking Ming-3 out to the center of the arena. That's not right. Those guys should only be guarding those corner patrol zones. That's not fair as Spin Doctor takes a little visit to the grinding wheel with his own grinder. Rick is backing up over the steam, back into the grinder again. Sir K, just after anybody. What's going on here? The rules have been thrown out of the arena, as they usually do in a tag team event. Sir K just picks Rick up, shucks him out of the arena. He wasn't even in that corner patrol zone. I bet the judges are going to have something to say about that. Oh, boy. And now it's just down to Ming-3 to fight it out against the Revolutionist and the Spin Doctor. The Revolutionist is right upside down. They're out of it. The 10-second clock is going down. Rapbot is counting out the immobility of the Revolutionist. This one is going to have to go to a judge's decision. But it's not going to be a popular one. Well, right from the beginning, the Revolutionist had all kinds of speed. But Rick went in there with that flipping arm and put him out of business. Then Spin Doctor was getting stuck. But the real problem here was the house bots taking advantage of the poor UK team. The judges have made up their mind. And I gotta tell you before I announce it, I'm, I'm a little uneasy because all of these teams feel that they won and you can make an argument for every single robot in each one of the teams. But the judges have decided that the new international tag team champion is the team of Ming-3 and Rick. They are the champions. The judges have ruled that Sir K's ejection of the Rick robot was an illegal ejection. They've ruled that. They've also ruled that the amount of damage to these teams, Spin Doctor and Revolutionist, was greater than the amount of damage inflicted to these teams right here. So that's why they decided to go in that direction. So congratulations to our champions, to our runner-ups. Could have gone either way. Fantastic match. Even though you guys didn't win, how do you feel about what happened out there? Uh, we played a really hard match, and we did our best. How did you feel during the match? Were you excited? Yeah, all right. Well, they were all excited, and I'm sure, obviously, you guys are excited about it. You're excited about the result. Tell me how you're feeling right now. Well, really happy that, we're, that we've won. So. Vivian is now going to present you with your hardware, the championship trophy. Give a round of applause for our international tag team champions, Rick and Hi. Congratulations, everybody. A great match, a great way to end the show. So that is it. Hope you guys had a great time. Join us next time for more of some of the best robots in the world on Nickelodeon Robot Wars. See ya. And next time on Robot Wars, you're going to see Bunny against the Owl in the Vengeance Battle, the Battle of the Spinners with Ninjitsu, and Ivan and his Bad Bot Tyrannobot up against newcomers Tut Tut for the main event, the Challenge Belt. And remember, building robots is extremely dangerous and should not be attempted without great care and parental supervision. For more information, please visit www.nick.com.